I still remember life before the war. I remember that we used to be different. We used to live up there, on the surface. We used to be the masters of the whole world. We built gigantic cities of glass and steel. We crossed the oceans at will. And we also conquered the skies. There used to be seven billion of us. We were not born for life in the tunnels. I was born to breathe fresh air, and I remember it. The seven billion were wiped out by the last war. Only 50,000 managed to survive underground, with the surface poisoned, burned, and teeming with horrible monsters. One day, the radiation on the surface might subside, and our grandchildren, or their grandchildren, might be able to return there. At least that's what my brothers in arms from the Order believe. Basically, there was no hope for us right off the start. Still, we humans are just too bad at surrendering. We tried to make the best of what we had, banded together, and worked to make the Metro our new home. After all, it might well be the only place left on Earth for humans to live. For a time, we thought we could make it, but, regrettably, the war didn't kill our bad habits. In the relative safety of the tunnels, corruption festered. And when danger came from above the ground, only a few of us stood against it. Our numbers dwindling by the day. But I remember we were born for a better life. And I can't accept that I'm destined to grow old and die underground. I don't care if I'm called an idiot. But if even a single shard of the old world still exists out there, I have to find it. Between endless years of hopeless existence and even a single moment of hope, I must choose hope. I must find that signal.
Where to now? Left, across the square! Hey, Demir, do you think the Colonel knows what Artyom been up to here? How am I supposed to know? Ask him yourself. He radioed from the ring, said he'd be here tomorrow. Hey, you! Leave him alone! I killed him myself with my slingshot. Let him learn to stand up for himself. How else can he hope to survive in the match? Rise and shine, people! Hang in there, Artyom. You gonna get a fresh dose of Spartan blood now? Artyom, 
Are you awake? It's okay. The doctor said you'll be fine. Are you trying to kill me with worry? What if next time you don't return from the surface? There's no one out there, Artyom. No one to find, no one to talk to. If there was, don't you think they'd be here already? We've talked about this again and again. You have to accept it. There's only us. Colonel. Hello, Alex. There you are, you stubborn fool. How many times are we going to have this conversation? I don't care if you kill yourself over this silly dream of yours. But don't you see what you're doing to my daughter? Your wife? Dad, please. The order is short on men after the battle for D6. But you leave. People need you. And you pursue your selfish obsession. But now this shit has to stop. There's only Metro, nothing else. And the Order is here to defend it. Because if not us, then who? You look fine to me. So get ready to go. Then we'll discuss your transfer to Polis. Come, we need to talk. I'll get the doctor. Artyom? Please, promise me this was the last time. I'll see you later. Artyom, we managed to bring you back from the brink, but people are giving you their blood, which could save so many wounded, and you keep bringing it back irradiated. Don't you think that is unfair? Let me put it this way. I can't promise I'll be able to bring you back next time. Still, lucky those Spartans are damn good. They brought Artyom here just in time. They sure are. I cannot remember the last time I saw a bunch of healthy and fit people down here. Yeah, me neither. It's a shame they spend so much time on the surface. Well, sadly, it's their job. Well, job or no job, if they keep doing that. Sana, I told you a hundred times already. You must come back to Polis. I left the order, and now nobody gets well, to decide for me. Artyom! Oh, I can't believe my eyes! Artyom! You're all right! You give us a scare, brother! Artyom! How are you, friend? I see Party you're me, all right. gentlemen, give way! This calls for a celebration. Oh, a few more scars and you'll be completely irresistible to any woman. Speaking of which, you are the you nurses you know, in the hospital, huh? You just stop crowding him. Uh, well, Welcome then. back, Artyom. Uh, uh, Previat, Artyom. All right, you're all dismissed. I give you two hours, people. Yeah! <laughs> oh, yeah. it's official. Yeah. I knew it. Like so this. I brought something. And here we go again. <laughs> Please, let's not repeat the last Hold time. Hold on, Artyom. 